Zurinam Toad Zurinam Toad is a fantastic kind of toad which you may not believe in when you first look at them. You would not even think if it's a toad, leaf, or rock on your first view. They are utterly motionless in the water. Regarding these toads, this is the thing, the Zurinam Toad's body is entirely flat, the head shape is triangular, and even the nostrils are present at the very edge of the two tubes. The Zurinam toad skin is also very rough and muddy, and the color is usually between grey-brown or olive. The toad's front legs consist of fingers containing a structure similar to the shape of a star, and that is why they are also known as Starfinger Toad. Apart from the appearance, the most spooky and fascinating thing about this toad is its reproductive behavior. You may get freaked out after listening to this, but it is imposing too. Zurinam Toad Birth However, giving birth to babies may not a pretty experience for everyone, but looking at a Zurinam toad giving birth to its child may make everyone stop and watch. The female Zurinam toad gives birth to the newbies by following a totally different method. Unlike other toads that first lay eggs and then nurture them, the Zurinam female keeps the eggs really close and does not put it in any water body. The Zurinam toad keeps her eggs under her skin until they can hatch. How the eggs hatch is another creepy story, as soon as the rainy season starts, the male toads come out and begin to find a mate. Toads do not make calls for attracting the female toad, on the other hand, they use their hyoid bone to make sounds. If a female gets attracted, she allows the male to get over her and start the breeding process. Once the grip is firm, the male and female stay in the same position for more than 12 hours. In this process, both partners remain attached together and begin to do somersaults in the aquatic habitat. At the same time, they are upside down. The female releases some eggs, the male grabs the opportunity, fertilizes the eggs and puts them back in the female holes. The female Zurinam toad can hold 60 to 100 eggs at a time, and her back begins to appear like a swollen honeycomb. Once the eggs are hatched, the babies inside start to push their hands out, and they find their way out of the female holes. Slowly, all the babies come out from their mother's holes fully mature. The central fact is that the babies do not come out as tadpoles, which are the traditional way, instead, they sprout out as developed toadlets. The tadpole stage has already been completed in the mother's back. The method aids the new one to come out safely as a proper toad in the world. The toadlets are also able to find food as soon as they are born. They also need no parental care after they are born. Zurinam Toad Care Zurinam toads look fascinating in the aquarium, however, they need special treatment and care as pets. Most of the frogs are wild caught, and they undergo a lot of stress and traumas before reaching the aquarium or tank. Most of the Zurinam toads appear motionless, and they do not start to eat if and only if they begin to feel safe. Due to these situations, it is complicated to tell if a Zurinam toad is suffering from tension or depression. Unless the toad is comfortable in its new environment, it is better to hold the toad in a towel. Why? Because at night, it may jump, which can result in injuries. Make sure to bind the towel on the screen's top with clips so that even when the toad tries to escape, it will be safe because of the towel. The temperature range for the Zurinam toad should be between 78 to 80 Fahrenheit. Make sure that you do not expose the toad to drastic temperature changes. Always be slow while changing their environment. Don't forget like and subscribe my channel and click on bell button for more videos.